Welcome back everyone to the NWA Wrestling Showcase as our main event continues. And fans, while we were away on break, Scrap Iron Adam Pierce taking over the advantage. He's in the driver's seat now of this big main event matchup. And look at Manor Pile getting on the action right there, choking TJ Perkins behind the ref's back. And look at the replay here during the break. Bam, a little whiplash on the part of uh, Adam Pierce to TJ Perkins right there. Really snapped his neck on the top rope, Todd. And that's what it took for Pierce to take over. And again, he is a finisher. When Pierce is in the advantage, when he's in that driver's seat, he is very, very tough. Tough to turn it around and get the advantage on him. Well, we all know, I mean, Adam Pierce, two-time former NWA World's Heavyweight Champion. This guy's, uh, you know, he's got all the tools. He's got to just uh, get a couple big wins here, and uh, he'll be uh, having a shot at Blue Demon Jr. in no time. Certainly, Jeff. Well, that remains to be seen. Obviously, somebody else that has a gripe and wants a title shot is none other than the shooter, Brent Albright. And again, just blatant choking. The official's back is turned. This is not a handicap match. This is ridiculous. You know, this is unacceptable. You know, we got to uh, get the refs in the NWA here a little bit more paying attention to the action. Uh, I, I can't believe Knox missed that one, Todd. Well, I mean, he, Rick Knox, the senior official, he's doing the best he can out there, but you, don't, you can't have eyes in the back of your head. That's for sure. Now, you have mentioned, Jeff, that this match so important to Pierce to keep his climb back to perhaps a title shot as he hooks him here for maybe a suplex outside in, brings him in the hard way, yes. But also... For TJ Perkins, he's trying to get back into the winning ways after losing that Heritage title. Here's the cover, only a two count. And speaking of which, uh, Jeff, we're gonna see the new Heritage champ in action on this program in just two weeks. Yeah, Ryan Taylor in action in a couple weeks. Uh, that'll be exciting to see. Oh, but there's the cover. Oh, and uh, TJ Perkins just escapes. One more note, Todd, remember, next week in action, Blue Demon Jr., the NWA World's Heavyweight Champion. The man who is on the top of the mountain right now, the reigning champion in action. Can't wait for that huge main event next week. But what a main event we have here tonight. Low bridge there by Pierce and TJ to the outside. Hey, Todd, speaking of which, you got any more of that uh, full throttle Blue Demon energy drink? I just love drinking that stuff, getting all pumped up during these matches. Thanks to our friend at Coca-Cola. You are quite the pitch man, and but I've been drinking it all night because I can tell you what, you gotta have energy to keep up with all the great action on this program, including in this main event. But this is not where Perkins wants to be. A scoop and a slam on the outside on the unforgiving concrete. This is the devil's playground. This is where Pierce is at home on the outside where everything goes. Well, you know, uh, Todd, Pierce is getting frustrated here. He wants the win now, and he wants to get out of here. Uh, the way I see it, the longer Adam Pierce is in the ring, the better chance T.J. Perkins has with his tremendous condition. But, uh, well, I guess Pierce proved me wrong right there, hanging out in the corner, taunting T.J. Perkins. Yeah, and right now it is Adam Pierce that is wrestling his match. And I you can't really even say wrestling. He's brawling. And T.J. is not going to beat Scrap Iron in a brawl. Scrap Iron, of course, hailing from Chi-Town, from the Windy City. Oh, well, you know, Todd, I mean, listen, TJ Perkins is uh, perhaps the best conditioned athlete here in the NWA. He, uh, you know, a little brawl from Adam Pierce isn't gonna keep this guy down. Well, he's down right now, and Pierce intends to keep him there. Big knee drops to the ribs, and when he's attacking that core section of his body, and again, so much explosiveness comes from the core, and TJ's not gonna be able to unleash some of those high-risk maneuvers if this onslaught keeps up by Scrap Iron. Into the ropes, and oh, and an abdominal stretch by Adam Pierce, uh, perhaps borrowing from uh, Mr. Wrestling Force playbook there, Todd. We yeah. saw him in action earlier tonight, but Adam Pierce now continuing to wear down that abdominal region and now driving the elbow into the rib cage makes it so hard to breathe. Such a painful maneuver there by Pierce. He knows every trick in the book, Jeff. Oh, and TJ Perkins with the hip toss to counter. Desperation maneuver and both men are down. And the fans there come to life really trying to urge on the youngster. Can he get back to his feet? He has uh, taken a lot of punishment in this one. Full head of steam, and now drives his shoulder right into the midsection again. Pierce is relentless. He's like a shark smelling blood in the water here, Jeff. Yeah, Adam Pierce knows what he's doing in that ring at all times, and oh, look look what he's doing here. Oh, here we go. CWN, uh, C. Edward uh, Vanderpile here doing what he's paid for. 
giving Pierce a hand in the action. Oh, so he's doing speak. what he's paid for. I guess he's cheating. Is that what he's paid for? Well, you know, I mean, listen. Uh, unfortunately, you win if you can, lose if you must, but always cheat. Uh. Yeah, I think I heard that somewhere earlier tonight in this broadcast. <laughs> but now again, the abdominal stretch, and this could end this matchup. There could be a submission, but Rick oh, Knox right. saw it. Now another hip toss by Perkins. Well, Perkins has to get himself, he's got to get himself up, get ready for that comeback. Perkins has to dig deep and do what he can to get the big W here, Todd. Well, the well of both men is being tested right now. Both guys look to be low in the fuel tank. Big reverse neck breaker there by Perkins out of nowhere. Excellent execution by TJ Perkins. And again, both men are down. Yeah, but Perkins unable to cover, unable to capitalize, and that could cost him. The referee starts a 10 count. I'll tell you what, I don't want to see a double count out here. I want to see a winner, Jeff. No, Todd, I agree with you. I've been excited for this main event, the whole program. I want to see a big W coming from somebody here. Here we go. Both men fighting their way back to their feet. Who is going to get the advantage? That may go a long way to deciding the victor in this matchup. And right now, it looks like Perkins, the fresher of the two. Yeah, He's Perk moving quick. Fl flying offense there, flying double knee to the corner. TJ Perkins is a ball of energy right here. Look at that springing double elbow backdrop there. Yeah, that was beautiful. Came with really kind of a flying European uppercut. Follows up with a nice knee drop. Some spring left in those legs. Hit him right on the jaw. Yeah, like I said, TJ Perkins digging deep, doing what he's doing his best, flying around the ring, coming off the ropes. Beautiful elbow drop by Perkins. Look at the execution. Going for the cover. One, two, he got, no, oh, so close. Very close there, and Perkins, I like that offense. Giving Pierce a taste of his own medicine, he now uses the elbow to drive it into the midsection, into the rib cage of Scrap Iron Adam Pierce. Perkins trying to get the fans to rally behind him, drawing that energy from the people, Todd. Yeah, much like a 12th man in football, it can really be a difference maker, an X factor. I don't think Pierce cares about the fans, but they're certainly helping out Perkins at this point. Yeah, whipping Pierce off the ropes, counter by Pierce, going for the backdrop, TJ's got it. Oh, and into a rolling Kimura arm bar submission, Todd. But Pierce is so close to the ropes. Yeah, it looks really like a, a straight arm bar to me, that flying arm bar. But now, pouring himself onto the apron, and Pierce is tapping. This match should be over. Perkins should be declared the victor. But again, as you mentioned, Vanderpile doing what he's paid for to cheat and uh, save the match for his man. Come on, Todd. I mean, that was heartbreaking. TJ Perkins had that match won. Yeah, it was heartbreaking. It was arm breaking potentially for Pierce. He was tapping out. This match should be over, but it might be 450 time. It might be only academic at this point. If he hits it, this thing's gonna be over. No, went for a senton, nobody home. And here we go, TJ in the corner. Wait, what's Pierce doing? Oh, his feet are on the ropes, Todd. You've gotta be kidding me. What a travesty here this is. Here is your winner, Scrap Iron, Adam Pierce. Todd Pierce stole that one. Stole it. I mean, that was so close. TJ was so close. And I got to think, I got to think, TJ Perkins definitely proved himself to Adam Pierce and to the NWA Board of Directors. This guy's the real deal. But for tonight, Adam Pierce stays on top once again. Yeah, he proved himself, but he didn't get a notch in the win column, and that is going to cost him. A loss is a loss. But moments before, Pierce tapped out. The match should have been over, and then Pierce having to resort to cheating to win. Fans, we'll see you next week when the NWA World Heavyweight Champ, Blue Demon, will be in action.